So I'm actually outside today in a beautiful woodland surrounding and there's so many inspirational things to look at to make a really good art project. Even these give you inspiration. So I've had an amazing afternoon in this beautiful woods and I've collected some amazing pieces. There's enough pieces to make at least four art projects. So let's go and make some. So I have to go into the woods. I've picked up some pine cones. And this is going to be the first project. So this is what we're going to be doing. This is an armadillo lizard. And I've picked the armadillo lizard because when you look at the scales on his body, it looks very much like a cone. So as we always do, draw out a rough outline of your lizard. No detail is needed. And if you look back at our picture, he's sitting on a rock and it must be the night time because it's very black. And I like this idea today to have a very black contrast background. So just use your pastels, your soft pastels like we always use. So just put your pastels on. And like we always do, smudge away. Now it should look like this. And if you look at the rock, it's like a bluey kind of grey colour. So we'll do that next using the same technique. It should now look a bit like this. Now you need to take your cone and carefully cut it in half. Take your time. It's quite tricky to do, but you can do it. Once this is done, you can leave some pieces like this or cut some up again into a quarter. So take your PVA glue and start with the tail. Make sure you put plenty of it down. And you're looking at the tail and you can see how the textures of the cone wraps around. So start tearing your cone down and gently sticking it into place. Following the lines around. So just take the small pieces that you cut and start placing them this way. But cut them up accordingly again to create the shape that you require. So it should begin to be looking a bit like this. But don't worry about the white edges right now. We can fill those in later on. Because when you look at the picture, it's got a very strong highlight going across here. If we look at his head, we can see that he's got quite raised pointy bits. So when you cut up your cone, look for some interest in shape. For his legs, you're using half a piece cut up and then just chop it up so it looks a bit like this and you just apply the whole piece down. So it should be looking a bit like this. Remember the white area I said at the top? Well if you look at the cone when you start chopping it up, the inside you'll see this line. So what we're doing is just stripping the excess cone pieces off and we're going to use this line and stick it down across the back. Now we need to define some areas with our black marker again. We need to start thinking about his feet so we need some claws in. So continue the three claws that you can see until they're finished. We need to begin thinking about his face. So this time we're just going to use the markers and start putting in his face. So create a dabbing effect because we don't want it too flat. And then simply use the black marker to start defining areas.
and just keep working on it until you think you've finished enough detail. So that's it, your finished abstract art piece of an armadillo lizard, just made from pine cones from the woodland bed.